Welcome to the TV5 Vault. I'm Chris Eastlick. 45 years ago this month, a major ice storm blew over mid-Michigan, causing power outages throughout the area. This event has been called one of the worst natural disasters to come across the state. TV5's Eric Gila takes a look at the ice storm of 1976. This is the way the weather looked 30 years ago tonight. The storm that earned the nickname the Great Ice Storm of 1976. And it was just one call after another. Power lines down on this car, and live wires down here, and tree branches down there, and uh, power outages all over the place. Uh, yeah, it, was, uh, it was something. And I, over you know, two I, days, there was an inch and a half of rain, which then froze. All this with 60 mile an hour winds. In Saginaw County, 50,000 were without power, and another 350,000 outside of the county were dark, too. It took until the 12th of March for consumers' power, along with crews from nearby states, to get everyone's power restored. There were evacuations to dozens of shelters. The National Guard was called in to help. Water was out in many areas, and rural residents were stranded for days because of all the trees down across the roads. Saginaw County's emergency director was a young city police officer then. One of the things that really sticks out is we had one officer that uh, everybody saw him driving around with his helmet on. Everybody said, what the heck is he wearing his riot helmet for? And we found out <laughs> after we got out on the streets there, would you'd be walking around, a branch would fall down. So everybody made fun of him, but not for too long. <laughs> Well, this storm caused trees and power lines to collapse across Michigan from Muskegon to Port Huron and throughout mid-Michigan. The Red Cross converted the Saginaw Civic Center, which is now the Dow Event Center, into an emergency shelter. If you have any memories of the ice storm of 1976, share them with us in the comments below. Thanks for joining us for this edition of the TV5 Vault. I'm Chris Eastlake.